time. It's time. Now, I have not done an unboxing in a hot minute because I've been focusing on all of this luscious hair. Let's see here. It's gonna have to work. Um, but it was time for a refresh on skincare and see if there's anything delicious that I need to try. Um, so I'm gonna unbox. Is that working? Did I turn this on? Obviously, it's been a little while since we've done this. I've been trying to just use up what I have um, and just buy it when I need it instead of feeling like, oh gosh, I don't know why, but probably from growing up, you know, not having a lot of money, I would like the nice stuff, but then I'd be afraid to use it because, <clears throat> I don't know, insecurity or scarcity mindset, just thinking I might not be able to have it again. So then, you know, I would not use it and then I wouldn't get to enjoy having it. Um, or I would always do the gifts with purchase with like Clinique or Estee Lauder or all of those just so I could have more of the high quality, nice stuff. So now that I'm a grown ass woman and I make plenty of money, I let myself buy the good stuff and I actually use it and I get the benefits of all of them that way and it's really nice. So this is box one. I actually paid for shipping this time too so I could get it when I actually wanted it, which you know you've made it when you're okay with paying for shipping. Okay, so this one has my Laura Mercier um, translucent setting powder. I use this, I like a dewy look, but I use that um, when I'm using my It Cosmetics CC cream because it just is very, very um, moist. <laughs> so I like to set that after I put my concealer on um, and I just use a little bit and it just keeps everything where it needs to be. Um, Laneige, the water cream. I am so excited about this. Um, water bank moisture cream. Normal to dry skin. I cannot wait. I was going to get the sleeping mask as well, but I still have one from Ahava. And um, I usually don't need one when it's not winter, but my skin has gotten so dry. Ooh, look at that. Oh, it's so pretty. Now I have to say, I don't know much about it. Um, comes with a little spoon to get it out, but it looked like it was going to be hydrating and I needed something to replace my Caudalie uh, SOS cream. And then finally, the Charlotte Tilbury Beautiful Skin Foundation. I'm so excited. This has a tube that's very similar to the It Cosmetics. Um, oh, it is locked up tight. Warm. Is it warm? This was basically the only color that they had left in stock and I think it's my color, so I'm going to go with it but it is just so beautiful. I tried to get the um, the bronzer and the blush out of stock. I will keep trying on that. So let me know below if you have used any of these before. Um, I love the Charlotte Tilbury lip stuff. I have um, the lip cheek liner in a couple of colors and I just ordered something else from here. I think it's the Hydrate Balm. Um, and then I also think I bought the skincare tester kit. I don't remember. I filled up the part good and then pared it down. So, okay. So this is one of my all time favorite skincare brands. I love everything about it. It's French, it's clean, and it works really well. Everything that I've tried is just fantastic. Um, but they always have these like little sets that have like the minis together. They're like large deluxe samples, travel size, whatever. These are a great way to get really good products, see if they work for you, but also it's an indulgence that feels really good. So that comes with the foaming cleanser, which I love. This is the Venusaurus Hydra SOS, um, this is the serum. I was going to buy a full size of this, but I haven't used this one yet. Um, and it does come with the SOS hydrating cream, which I have almost finished. Oh, it's a full size of that. I guess I will be well hydrated. Um, I'm almost done with my current one. So this is just, okay. But $42 for all of those is actually really not bad. So this is a really rich hydrating um, moisturizer. It doesn't feel sticky or greasy and it works really well. Love it. 
This is the Magic Skin Secrets from Charlotte Tilbury. Um, this has a clay mask, a serum crystal elixir, the magic cream, which is instant turnaround moisturizer. That's what I really wanted to try. And then Wonder Glow is an instant soft focus beauty glow primer. So that'll be really nice too. So I like trying skincare in sets like this. I've done it with um, Ole Henriksen. I've done it with Caudalie a lot. And so I'm trying Charlotte with all of that. Um, also, I just, Sephora has great little kits that have lots of good stuff even like makeup. I've done lots with Benefit. They're just awesome. Oh, okay. So I did get a couple of, um, of their like bonus things that you can use points for. And one is the lemonade smoothing scrub from Ole Henriksen, which they're really great products. I need a new face scrub for in the shower. CC cream. This is, these are this, the creams that I use, the it cosmetics. Um, the one I have is neutral tan. So it's a little bit lighter than this one. But um, I was thinking my daughter could try some, but her skin is super fair. So those are too light for her, but this actually works really well. These little travel size things when you're, these samples work when you're traveling. So I will throw that in and use it just as a concealer or whatever. And it takes up zero space. Um, I did also get the, um, I've never used the acne solutions from Clinique Clearing Gel. So teenage daughter, sweet thing, give that to her. And then sample of the ombre leather. Usually has really nice smelling stuff. Mmm. Ooh, you really actually do smell leather in there. Oh, that's crazy. I did not expect it to actually smell like leather. Mmm, that's a little sexy. I like that. And then the last thing, oh, this is the Charlotte Tilbury. This is in Pillow Talk, which I have Pillow Talk and Iconic Nude for my lip sheets. Those are amazing colors. This is the Hyaluronic Happy Kiss Color Balm. I have lips on right now, so I won't use this, but let's see. Mm, I picked some good stuff. So I will probably do uh, reviews. The packaging is just so beautiful. I love because it's kind of vintage looking. Don't be alarmed if it takes a while to come up. And why do I smell <laughs> lip gloss? All right, so that does not turn back down. Hopefully I didn't go up too far. That, I'm not sure if I like that. Okay, we'll try that and see. Um, hmm. you never know. You never know. All right. So I will try this stuff. I will probably do some reviews and let me know if you've used any of the products that I have. Um, and you can tell me anything about them or other recommendations based on what I've purchased today. Let me know. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye.